A Soviet spacecraft is falling back to Earth after more than 50 years in orbit. Cosmos 482 was launched in 1972 for a mission to Venus, but a rocket failure left it trapped around Earth. Now it's expected to re-enter the atmosphere between May 8th and May 12th. The concern isn't just that it's falling, it's what it's made of. Cosmos 482's descent module was built to survive the extreme heat and pressure of Venus, far more intense than what it will face during Earth re-entry. That means it might not burn up. It could stay intact and hit the ground. If it does, impact speeds could reach 150 miles per hour. The possible landing zone covers almost half the planet, including the US, UK, Australia, South America, Africa, and parts of Asia. The exact point won't be known until shortly before it comes down. Most of Earth is ocean, so the chances of it hitting a populated area are low, but they're not zero. And the spacecraft isn't steerable, it's just falling. This isn't ordinary space debris, it was built to withstand more than any Earth-based system. That's why it's still up there, and why this re-entry is being taken seriously.